Welcome everyone, this is Zonta with Weeper Products. Today's video is on what's new in AutoCAD 2024. This is a PowerPoint presentation only. I will have additional videos on each of the updates in the near future. AutoCAD 2024 has been designed for the challenges of today and tomorrow. There are three areas that we're going to focus in on for the PowerPoint presentation. Accelerated creativity, tailored functionality, and connected design experience. Let's take a look at the accelerating creativity aspects of 2024 AutoCAD. Speaking of accelerating creativity, the intention is to focus quickly on creating collaborating your solutions using artificial intelligence assistive machine learning to improve your design workflows. Using the new AutoCAD 2024, you'll notice how much faster things open up and how much faster it is to switch between model and viewports. And it is a much more robust and faster than previous versions. With Activity Insights, we are now using the machine learning to look at your AutoCAD collaborative workflows help you stay connected to all of your data throughout the different lifecycle projects. This Activity Insights is included in AutoCAD 2024. It is not in the LT version. The My Insights Macro Advisor and Dashboard will give you balloon notification of what's going on and will help you with trying to improve your workflow and do things a little bit faster. Again, this is only in AutoCAD 2024 and not in LT. The count and blocks palettes have now been updated to be able to function and work much faster. Counting blocks is now up to 70% faster. And reusing design center content with the blocks is up to 47% faster. This applies to both the full version and LT of 2024 AutoCAD. We now have Smart Block Placement. The software uses machine learning to automatically place blocks based upon other ad adjacent entities and your previous behavior. This applies to 2024 and LT as well. Smart Blocks also now has replacement functionality. You can now select a block or group of blocks and have them replaced with a different block right away using the new command. This will help you with speed and functionality down the road. Now let's go ahead and take a look at the second aspect of the PowerPoint presentation, tailored functionality. In regards to tailored functionality, we have the ability to customize AutoCAD, obviously, um, to make sure, you know, you use it the way you're supposed to use it, and also to help you with creating discipline-specific routines for your workflow. When we take a look at the AutoCAD vertical products and how the different products will help you become more efficient, the average productivity gain for all of them across the board is 63% for use with those specialized tool sets. If we look at the AEC tool sets, you'll notice there are significant percentage increases in each of the different verticals. AutoCAD Architecture, AutoCAD MEP, Plant 3D, Map 3D, and Raster Design. They all hit at least 48% or higher. If we look at the Product Design and Manufacturing tool sets, for mechanical, electrical, and raster design, we see that it also hits at least 48% productivity gain. We also have AutoCAD for Mac, and it's been built to handle and work with the M-Series chips. They have added support for Apple Silicon um, for this chip, and the performance increase is roughly two times. This applies to both full-blown version and LT versions of AutoCAD. 2024. Third area we want to look at is 
connected design experience. When we talk about connected design experience, we're talking about the ecosystem of the software and how to be able to use the software across multiple platforms and work collaboratively together with all of your partners. We have Web Autolisp API is now available. It started out in the previous version and continues in this version for the full-blown version of AutoCAD 2024. It allows for customization and automation of a sequence of automated commands in AutoCAD on the web. We have Autolisp as well, which is now included in AutoCAD LT. And so you can start using some of the different source files, such as Autolisp source files, compiled LSP files, fast load Autolisp files, and Visual Lisp application files as well. Markup and import assist both have been improved quite a bit to allow for working with markups that you bring into your file. It does recognize text. It does allow for text replacement. Uh, and it also understands some basic handwritten text that refer back to commands. And we'll take a look at this in future videos using the software. This applies to the full-blown version of AutoCAD 24 and not to the LT version. With the advent of using the software in multiple environments and multiple platforms, you have the ability to install it and use it on your desktop, your laptop, your tablet, or other communicative devices, even your phone. And you can use the full-blown version of the software and the versions that are specifically made for those devices. Using the portfolio and taking a look at it, you'll see we have full-blown version of AutoCAD, we have LT version, and we have AutoCAD for web. So you can actually go to web.autocad.com and be able to use the software there in a minimal way to access your files and do redline markups and collaboration. And that is our PowerPoint presentation for AutoCAD 2024. Again, watch for future videos on each of the point-specific updates for the 2024 release of AutoCAD. Thank you very much for watching.